It has been noted that animal cells are sensitive to excessive mechanical agitation. A low agitation rate is usually used in cell culture. The major purpose of agitation in mammalian cell culture is to suspend cells or microcarriers and achieve fluid mixing, not to disperse air bubbles for enhancement of oxygen transfer as in microbial cultures. The use of microcarriers and cell culture poses somewhat different agitation requirements than for free cell suspensions. The diameter of microcarriers is in the range of 150 to 200 microns, as opposed to 10 to 20 microns for free cells. The terminal settling velocity of microcarriers and cell culture medium is almost two orders of magnitude higher than that of free cells. This implies the existence of a much higher relative velocity between the microcarriers and the fluid than between free cells and the fluid. Cells on microcarriers therefore experience a higher fluid shear force than free cells do. At present, the impeller agitated stirred tank reactor is still the most widely used in microcarrier cultures. The liquid height to tank diameter ratio is typically slightly over one. A marine type impeller or paddles with pitch blades are preferred to turbines. The agitator is typically placed at a distance from the vessel bottom equal to approximately 40% of the total liquid height. The impeller diameter to tank diameter ratio for a microcarrier culture vessel is usually higher than that for a microbial fermenter. The relatively fast settling velocity of microcarriers is best illustrated by stopping the agitation in a microcarrier culture. A microcarrier free zone is quickly established at the top of the vessel after agitation stops. A minimum agitation required to keep microcarriers completely in suspension should be used at the beginning of the culture. The impeller speed shown for this confluent culture is somewhat higher than that which should be used for a culture in its initial growth period. With a marine impeller or the pitched blades, the fluid can be pumped either upward or downward. Our observation with one to two liter vessels revealed no difference in cell growth whether the fluid was pumped either upward or downward. However, we feel that pumping the liquid upward is better. An easy way of designing your own impeller is to use a glass jar with an impeller attached to an agitator. The blades of the impeller can be modified by attaching plastic plates to them. The agitation rate can also be adjusted. The movement of microcarriers under different agitation conditions can then be visualized by using microcarriers stained with tripan blue.